Hello everybody, how are you? This is Scott Thakpo and I'm a leadership coach, author and travel explorer. Why is it that people don't voluntarily take accountability for their own pleasant thoughts? A voluntarily, you know, voluntary approach is absolutely essential when it comes to our own well-being. Because nobody is going to pesterize you, nobody is going to repeat this. That you need to have pleasant thoughts. Just think, how many times have you been told right from your childhood that you need to have pleasant thoughts? You would have been told not to do this, not to do that, study, 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 become something in life, deep reinforcement. But nobody has ever told you that it's very, very important to have pleasant thoughts. Because at the end of the day, thoughts have such an incredible presence in our lives and when we don't value the presence of thoughts then it will be very very natural on our part to feel low and to feel you know deprived of well-being this is happening to a large variety of people for a variety of reasons and this has to be understood deeply until and unless one understands this deeply, we will not be able to progress towards a life which is going to be absolutely fantastic. So start cultivating pleasant thoughts. Because if you are not going to cultivate pleasant thoughts, invariably, whatever is latent inside you will find its own meaning to create an emporium of feelings. And from the emporium of feelings will arise certain kinds of thoughts and those thoughts will have a direct and deep impact in the way in which you begin to perceive life around you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what is happening to a large variety of people. Their own life is completely in doldrums. And why it's in doldrums? Simply because they have not paid any attention to their internal states. It's very important that people pay total attention to their internal states so that life becomes extremely fantastic for them. So start cultivating pleasant thoughts. And how do you do that? By pleasant memory enablement. Yes, every human being in the planet has pleasant memories. You have to do a pleasant memory recall. You have to re-instruct this information inside yourself. And if you're not going to do that, you will simply lose out on a grand possibility of those fantastic feelings that you will get when you are simply inducing and subjecting yourself to pleasant thoughts. Just imagine if you're driving your dream car, how, how would you feel? If you're going on your dream vacation, how would you feel? Now there's two ways, one you go ahead, do all the hard work and then feel good or use the existing resources within yourself to feel good. Let me tell you many people have been very very blessed to have good memories and very few percentile of people have been blessed with fantastic memories and if you're not going to use that pleasant experiences, what would I say? It is a curse in big way. So heal yourself of the curse and instantly and immediately start accessing the pleasant thoughts and let there be an emporium of pleasant feelings within you. Good day and have a very wonderful time. This is Karthik Puvanam. I'm a leadership coach, author and travel explorer. I will see you in another amazing video. Good day.